He might be the heartthrob of K-dramas, but ask K-drama actresses what they think of Kim Seon Ho, and you'll get a mix of admiration for his talent and a side eye at the controversies. So what is it they're saying about the talented actor? Let's find out. Actress Shin Min Ah and Kim Seon Ho hit the cover page of Elle magazine back in 2021. The duo at that time were about to star in the romantic comedy Hometown Cha Cha Cha, where they took the chill coastal town of Gongjin by storm, turning a remake of Mr. Hong into a hit. Before the series lit up screens, the amazing actors gave a candid interview, revealing all there is to know about the drama and their respective careers. Shin Min Ah, in particular, had this to say about working with Kim Seon Ho. I was surprised that he did everything well, just like his character Hong Du Shik, who is good at everything. I know that Hong Du Shik will be loved by many people. I'm grateful to Kim Seon Ho for always making me feel comfortable on the drama set. On their on screen chemistry, she said, We have such great acting chemistry. Kim Seon Ho has such a great personality and is a type of a person who makes others comfortable. I wanted to have flexibility in acting with this series and Kim was so considerate, I think we clicked very well. The thespians would go on to give a fantastic performance in the series as Hometown Cha 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 wasn't just a blip on the radar. It cruised to the top, bagging the title of one of the highest rated Korean cable dramas ever. Eight weeks at number one and the finale, a cool 12% nationwide rating watched by over 3.2 million pairs of eyes. After the show wrapped up, there was a bit of drama in Kim Seon Ho's world as he got caught up in a scandal with his ex. It was like a roller coaster ride with apologies, defenses, and a dash of celebrity gossip. Fans of the duo couldn't help but notice that Shin Min Ah didn't hit the unfollow button amid the chaos. Seems like a subtle nod of support and a sprinkle of, you've got this for the innocent actor. In 2019, Kim Seon Ho took on the lead role in Catch the Ghost, a drama that marked Moon Gyun Young's return after a four year hiatus since her last project in 2016. The actress had tried her luck on the big screen with resounding success. Wanting to make a big comeback on television, she accepted a role in Catch the Ghost, a series that centers around a team of subway police chasing a serial killer known as the Subway Ghost, hiding in a subway station. This drama marked the first collaboration between Moon Gyun Young and Kim Seon Ho, and their bond was there for all to see. Gyun Young had nothing but compliments for her male colleague as they developed a close friendship. The remarkable chemistry between their characters, Yu Ryung and Go Ji Sok, became a major selling point for Catch the Ghost. Next up is Moon Ga Young, the talented K drama actress who is best friends with Kim Seon Ho. When the magazine outlet Elle Korea asked her to reveal which co star she had the most fun working with, the 27 year old, who has worked with big names like Wu Do Hwan, Hwang and Yup, and even Cha Eun Woo, had an interesting choice in Choi Woo Shik. Now, why would she do that? The actress jokingly talked about her best friend, Kim Seon Ho, having a short fuse. Moon Ga Young had this to say, The wisest thing to do is to pick the person who's the easiest in getting upset, so that I can maintain good relationships. Kim Seon Ho gets upset easily, so yes, Wushik, I'll pick you. Still very much best friends, the duo's friendship goes way back to the set of Welcome to Waikiki 2 in 2019. Yep, they've been buds for quite a while now. So when you see them laughing it up together, just know it's not just for the cameras. These two are the real deal when it comes to friendship goals. Han So Hee, the rising star in the South Korean entertainment scene, is gearing up for a major role in a new drama by the esteemed Hong sisters. And for the exciting twist, the amazing actress will be sharing the screen with the expressive talent Kim Seon Ho. But what's disheartening is that this promising pairing has stirred a storm of criticism. As soon as the news hit the internet, Korean netizens flooded social media with hate messages for Han So Hee, urging her to reconsider the offer. The reason behind this uproar lies in the previous massive controversy surrounding Kim Seon Ho, which has left many worried about the potential impact on Han So Hee's reputation. Despite Kim Seon Ho being cleared of all accusations with undeniable evidence and emerging as the actual victim of the controversy, Korean netizens remain cautious. There's a lingering concern that Kim Seon Ho's past history might cast a shadow on Han So Hee's otherwise stellar achievements. But then some fans believe these criticisms don't necessarily dictate the trajectory of both Han So Hee and Kim Seon Ho's illustrious acting careers. In fact, Kim Seon Ho has showcased his impeccable skills as South Korea's king of expressions in his recent movie, The Child. Han So Hee and Kim Seon Ho have a history of a close and strong relationship, notably after their collaboration in 100 Days My Prince. 
Their relationship is evident through adorable interactions like they had at the 2022 Asia Artist Awards. Given their established bond, it's likely that these criticisms will have minimal sway over Han So Hee and Kim Seon Ho's decisions regarding the new drama offers. Long before the abortion controversy stirred things up for Kim Seon Ho, he was already making positive waves among his female colleagues. In the MBC 2018 melodrama, You Drive Me Crazy, Kim Seon Ho joined Lee Yu Young for a press conference. This two episode series centers on the complexities of love and friendship. When Lee Yu Young and Kim Seon Ho's characters grapple with the aftermath of a night together, the talented actress Lee shared her experience saying, It's my first time portraying a bright character. I had fun while filming. I was a bit scared to act in this. I worried a lot if I could enjoy it while doing it. But when I actually went for it, it was really fun. On her colleague, Kim Seon Ho, the chemistry wasn't just on screen as they seemed to get a good vibe from each other before production kicked off. Lee Yu Young revealed the behind bicker between her and Kim. When we first met at the first script reading, we had a difference in tone while going over the script. I thought that we needed to synchronize that, so we read it a lot, and later it matched up. Kim was open-minded, accepting, and gave good reactions, so we had good chemistry. Just like how we appear in the drama, we also bickered in real life. In You Drive Me Crazy, Lee Yu Young played the role of Yun Seong, a translator juggling Korean to French and French to Korean translations. This role marks a special milestone for Lee Yu Young, known for her stellar performances in films. Making her drama debut in Okian's Tunnel, teaming up with Kim Seon Ho stirred up quite the anticipation. 2021 was a torrid year for the Korean entertainment scene. The fans and media weren't prepared for the bombshell that came their way when it came to light that Kim Seon Ho allegedly pressured his girlfriend into an abortion. Interestingly, Kim wouldn't be the only one facing the heat as everyone remotely associated with him got some of the bad energy, especially actress Im Yuna, who was set to co-star with the 37-year-old actor in the romantic comedy Two O'Clock Date. Despite the soaring expectations post hometown cha-cha-cha, Kim Seon, Ho's trajectory took an unexpected nosedive. In the aftermath, brands quietly erased Kim Seon, Ho's face from their home pages. Projects scrambled to replace him, and the fallout extended to those working alongside him. As for Yuna, the female idol and actress faced unwarranted social media attacks from the yet-to-be-released on-screen partnership with Kim Seon Ho, though the actress still remains tight-lipped about the whole incident. Sources hinted she was very disturbed by her colleague's actions and the subsequent backlash she received from it. Kim Seon Ho might have found it rough because of his terrible experience in his last relationship, but it appears some of his female colleagues are looking past it. But how will he continue to enjoy the goodwill of the industry? I guess we have to wait and see.